Hi guys, hello, hi, how are you? Um, today I woke up disgustingly late. Like, I don't even want to say how late I woke up because it's just like all of my day is basically gone now. So, um, I'm starting it now and I'm gonna get the most done that I can in this freaking day that I just wasted. Oh, dang it, I hate when I do this. Larry's mad at me because he has to eat, so I'm gonna do that now. I'm gonna feed myself. You guys are sitting in a cabinet right now because the angle's like pretty good. Lighting, eh, not so good, but you know, what can you do? I wanna unpack today. I need to respond back to a bunch of emails today. I need to get internet today. I need to call people and do things and blah. There's so many things when you move that you just like forget that you have to do. And yeah, so I'm gonna do those things. All right, and I have to upload a vlog. Ah, uh, okay, talk soon. Brought my man over to play with my other man. Me and my mans. Hi guys. Lindsay's doing all of her laundry that it's she been a long she day. threw into her um my bathtub. into her bathtub. About, like, four hours, guys. It's okay. Almost done. Do you see me wearing this band? Mm, not really. Okay. It's not like ugly though. But it's, it's just, just like, like if I have if I only wore it once in three years. Yeah, exactly. All my stuff that's, that's that was my mindset this is when all I was. Stuff that I'm gonna be selling. Hopefully, wow. Listing on wow. Depop. Yeah, baby. <laughs> we'll see how that goes. I am uploading my first moving vlog currently. It's like my empty apartment tour. So that's happening. And then I'm gonna uh, probably just start editing yesterday's vlog currently too, so I can get that up. Uh, yeah, and just like schedule it for tomorrow or something. Woohoo! Okay, so I am rejoicing because I got all of my editing done, so I don't have to worry about that. I just like uploaded my um, moving vlog that's gonna go up tomorrow, and so I'll just like stop by here tomorrow or something to figure that out, but I'm just gonna leave my laptop here just to upload. And then I'm gonna go back to my apartment with Larry, and I'm gonna get some unpacking done. Also, before I go over there, I just wanted to say a couple of random disclaimers really quickly because my first moving vlog just went up today, so you guys saw my new place for the first time. I do not live in the same apartment building as Lindsay. I wish I did. Did, honestly, but I live a couple blocks away. So no, we don't live in the same apartment complex Also, thank you guys for all the love on that video You guys are loving the new space and I'm loving my new space and it's just great second announcement The no jumper podcast is live a lot of you have seen it I just hadn't mentioned it in a vlog yet, but I had mentioned it on snapchat So like I said a lot of you have been like telling me that you loved it and you watched it and everything like that But yeah, I don't know basically I just wanted to announce it say I'll link it down below We talked about a bunch of like real af things. So I just liked the conversation Conversation, you know, I feel like we're more open than most of the time that we get like interviewed I guess that's kind of what it was like they were just asking us all of the real and hard-hitting questions So that was a fun time to do that podcast and yeah Thanks to you guys for all the lovely comments on there Honestly, the video has a lot of dislikes because their fan base is used to like him interviewing rappers and like porn stars And I don't know I think it was just random for him to have us on the podcast But you know props to him for doing that because I love when people like branch out of their shell and he has had interviewed other youtubers in the past too so it's not that random but yeah just a quick you know random disclaimer thank you guys for the love because there wasn't much love on that video but all of our audience who is watching it is like oh my god I love the podcast it was so cool to see you guys on there and a lot of my home friends too are like reaching out to me or random guy friends are reaching out to me being like oh I saw you on no jumper that's cool as fuck so yeah I'll see you guys when I'm home guys I think I'm finally done organizing my closet so this section has changed like 500 times but up here I have scarves and then I just have like pullovers and grandpa sweaters and then I have all of my hoodies then we have maxi dresses overalls regular dresses maxi skirts long pants shorts regular skirts body suits halters crop tops and all that jazz then we have long sleeve shirts and zip up hoodies and jackets and vests and sweaters and like little stuff like this that just you know you throw over your shoulders ponchos the whole nine yards so yeah, this system makes sense to me. So that's how I organized it and look at all of my hangers Half of these hangers are from stuff that I'm now donating and then the other half is stuff that I realized like why am I even hanging this up? Like this is all t-shirts that I was hanging up. Like why was I hanging up t-shirts? They're t-shirts I was also hanging up my flannels and such and my sweatpants at the time So you know what? I'm just gonna get a dresser and put all of this stuff in there all this stuff in there and uh, my jeans up at the top here and maybe my swimsuits waste my life 
with you. I'm so happy this is done. This was like such a task and I was working on it yesterday too, last night. And now it's just like, I think it's really done. Now we just gotta get rid of these and sort through everything in here and make sure that everything's, you know, in its right place. And then I get to put up all of my shoes. Woohoo! Yay, Larry! Have you even been in the vlog today, sir? Yeah, no, you totally have. He literally just yelled at me, yeah! I finally found my little hat rack thing. Thank God I cleaned out that white thing because it was at the bottom of that. So woohoo, all the hats are hanging, all the clothes are hanging. Wow, my wardrobe looks very colorful right now. I'm honestly living for it. I straight up have so much wall decor, it's insane. I came over here to finish freaking unpacking this box and it's just all signs. This wall is probably gonna be all art from you guys, like my old office was because I want my workspace to be over here but I don't know where the frick to put like all of my other signs I also got rid of a lot of my posters like in my kitchen the only posters I have left are this rip and dip one that I just recently got and this sunflower grateful dead one but the rest of them are gonzo but yeah it's just ridiculous like that's all wall art all of this is wall art this whole entire thing just I mean I love it all but it's like, how do I put this much stuff on my walls? I don't know where to put it. <sighs> I'm really overwhelmed right now, guys. PJ fits, boy. Okay, freed up a bit more space, clearing those boxes out. But honestly, I really just emptied them, moved my wall decorations to this specific corner of the room. And now we have the giant, exquisite, leaning tower of boxes. I have all of these, and then I have this that just has other recycling in it as well. But I'm digging the new space. I can put my foot over here now, so that's exciting. It's literally just like outlining the room with junk. And this is all just living room stuff, and I really don't have a living room yet because I don't have a couch and I don't have a coffee table, so it's not like I can, you know, store stuff in different places and that's holding a bunch of shit right now this bench so i just need a dresser i need a bookcase a couch and possibly a coffee table but probably not because i'm actually going to put my hanging chair from my first apartment up in this corner i decided me and drew decided this last night actually i can't take credit for the placement of the chair he was like i really liked at your first apartment how a bunch of people could be sitting on the bed but then one person who was in the chair could still be part of the conversation so i think you should put it near your bed so i was like okay and then if i put the couch here then we could just have so much more room for activities and for friends but yeah, and then we gotta find a freaking place for my trunk of linens. Gotta find a place for my altar. I'm thinking the altar could go by the window over here, but I'm not 100% sure yet. I'm not 100% sure about any of this. You saw me change my closet five times. But yeah, I am sure about this being my office space because it's just the perfect little nook. And also this was just the perfect little nook for my little bistro table. It's just like, I need to take each section of the apartment by itself and just deal with it and make everything, you know, fit in that area. So that's why I was doing my closet for so long because I had to tailor it to fitting these exact things. I guess what I'm trying to say is it takes time and I always like to do things like this. My friend Gina back home and I always are like, I'm so glad that we're friends because we both like to get shit done. You know what I mean? I just love people who get stuff done fast. So sometimes I'm thinking like that and I'm like, oh my gosh, I just have to get this done as soon as possible. But making your apartment look nice and desirable takes months. Like I'm just thinking back to all of the times that I redid my my old apartments, you know Like there was always stuff being added on so it's never really finished as the kids say or the adults who live alone say <laughs> But we're taking it day by day and yeah, that was my four and a half minute long rant of a clip So I'm gonna put you guys down now. Okay after that long talking clip I just realized that it's like freaking 2 30 and I'm also on low battery So I should probably just end this and hit the hay I just need to get to bed too so that I don't wake up as late as I did today That was just a and I'm like still low-key mad about it, but whatever what can you do it already happened? You know we took our day as it came and tomorrow will be better Okay, I'll see you guys tomorrow then and together we will conquer the mess of unpacking more and more day by day Decorating finding homes for little things little nooks and crannies and my camera is really really about to die on me now Okay, Megan stop talking give this video a big thumbs up for me if you enjoyed it and I'll just see you tomorrow Okay, stay smiling. Bye you got the whole world in your hands